And we're here with Edward Garza. And uh, Edward, thank you for taking a minute to see Absolutely. me. Now, just so you know, I am the king of mortgage guy. That's one of the reasons I do this is because I want to promote your business. Absolutely. And if somebody wants a mortgage, you are running anybody that needs real estate, I want you to tell them to call my. You got it, man. All right, sir. So first thing I'd like to start with is just where are you from? Where did you grow up? Uh, I grew up on the north side of Houston. I went to uh, MacArthur High School. Oh, yeah. And uh, I grew up in that area. I'm, I've been in Kingwood for over 20 years now. Wow. And, uh, you know, a lot of lacking uh, authentic Mexican restaurants here back in the day. Absolutely. There's a lot more now, you know what I mean? But not really authentic. I provide the real authentic Mexican food. Um, you know, handmade tortillas that are not made until ordered and stuff I'm like that. That makes a difference. Oh, absolutely, absolutely. And uh, you know, I wanted to bring that into the into Kingwood. I'm going on 12 years now here. Been yeah. here for 12 years. You know, all the things. A lot of people are very apprehensive about taking that big step of going into business by yourself. What compelled you to do that? Um, well, I was. Uh, this spot came up. This place used to be a. It should be city, it should be a hot dog place here back in the day. Right. And when they went out of business, I was looking for a location. And I wanted to be in the center of everything. So this place popped up and my wife and I were driving around and she's the one that actually found this place, my wife did. Came in, we looked at it and said, hey, let's do it. Let's, you know, we took a shot, you know, and straight off the back, we ended up, we, we did really well. We did really well right out of the gate. You know, we came out and um, there were nowhere you could get breakfast tacos. Absolutely, unless it was one of the big guys up there. Okay, so uh, you decided to open up. Now, was it the meat market part? It was. It was. It was. it was. it was a meat market. I was going into opening up a meat market because there wasn't a meat market here in Kingwood, and there was a kitchen here. So I said, you know what, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to make breakfast tacos and lunch tacos. And bring that recipe, that you know, that real authentic recipe here. So, and man, believe it or not, that's what made my business just take off. You know what I mean? Uh, I sell meat. You know, I have a small showcase, but the tacos really, really took. Yeah, I just took off, man. Everybody enjoyed the tacos. When I first opened, people were walking by. They were just looking. They weren't really coming in at first. What is so, this place? Man, I was like, I was getting kind of worried at the moment. So I said, you know what? I'm gonna give away free tacos to anybody that walks by. So my kids were babies at that time. Yeah. So I was giving samples to people. The, the donuts were right here next door and their line came across my door. <laughs> and people would just look in and I was like, man, you know what? I'm gonna give away free tacos. So that's what we did. And we gave away uh, free tacos for three days. Everything was free for anybody that walked by. And man, people were just getting out of line and coming in here to get the tacos. And once, once they got the taste, that's it. It, it, it just took off after that. You know what I mean? And we've been fortunate. We've been here for 12 years. Um, we're going on 12 years. March 6th will be our 12th year. Nice. So, man, we're, we're part of the community. Um, you know, we've, had, we've all been in here. I've been shocked. I've been in your late sometimes. There's high school kids all over this place. I've seen high school kids graduate. They come back already. They're grown. Man, I don't even recognize them <laughs> from the time that they came in when they were young, you know. And they say they come in from out of town from college. And, hey, man, this is the first place I come to. I just flew in. I haven't even went home yet. I came straight over here, you know what I mean? So it makes me feel good, you know, that I'm putting a product out there that people really like. Well, it's authentic, like you said, and uh, it's a great business. And what a need in the community. Absolutely, absolutely. So I've lived in Kingwood for over 30 years. And when we first got here, we, we came from San Antonio. And that's where I learned how breakfast tacos are a staple of my diet. Absolutely. Right? So absolutely. I knew we needed to find it. So, a couple questions. I come in, I get the same thing every time. And my wife gets the same thing every time. What are we missing? What's the number one seller? Uh, we have the basic tacos for breakfast, you know, the bacon and the uh, and, uh, potato. Uh, we offer chorizo and egg, and we offer uh, huevos a la mexicana, which is a real authentic taco. Describe that to me. Uh, it's egg, and it has tomato, onion, cilantro, and a little bit of serrano, and we cook it up. And man, it's really, really good. But uh, what really has taken off here is our barbacoa tacos. 
Our bar patrol, bar patrol talking about. You may be sure, man. Uh, it's the beef cake meat. Uh, it's just like the shredded beef. You garnish it with cilantro and onion, and you put it. I like corn tortillas. Uh, a lot of people like our flour tortillas, but either one, it does not matter. They are amazing. And then, of course, we have our classics: the beef fajita, the chicken fajita. You know, those are our classic tacos. Uh, people come in here and get those tacos all day long. You know what I mean? Um, we also have tortas. Tortas are a, a, a bread. It's like a French bread. You cut it in half, and we put beans, we put the meat, lettuce, tomato, avocado, and mayonnaise. And man, it's a great sandwich. It's the only sandwich that we sell here, but it is amazing. And uh, I've added that to my menu about three or four years ago, and man, forget it. It's a winner. It's a winner. And uh, of course, we sell. Uh, Fajita by the pound. You can come in here and get a fajita meal. Uh, you can get a pound of fajita mix, just beef, chicken and beef, whatever you like. It comes with rice, beans, tortillas, pico de gallo, a little bit of everything, you know. And everything's made to order. Everything's freshly made. We don't make nothing until you order it. That's, I think that's the number one reason we've been able to, you know. Yeah, it's, it's interesting because. My next question to you was about the lunch. I mean, I come in here for breakfast tacos, but I see these people in here for Oh, lunch is a big deal. Lunch is a big deal. Um, lunch, I think, is one of my busiest times of the day. Uh, it starts about 11.30, and it'll go on till about, you know, 2 o'clock around there. But, man, the line is out there. Well, the testament to that was, so <laughs> was all the guys that worked in the yard. That's right. And, that's right. There, and up, and you know, those, that's where you got to go, man. Those guys know, man. Uh, they love to eat authentic food. And, I mean, they already know me, man. They come in here and they rock and roll. They, they, I, I know everybody by name that comes in here. You know, I welcome it. I welcome a man. That's what you did, man. They love it. You know what I mean? And, uh, some people already know what they want. I, just, I see them, I put their order in. By the time they get up there, they just got to pay, you know. So they love that type of stuff, man. And we like it. We like it. We love being here. So, so that, I think, is the key thing is, first off, you're good at what you do. You know what's important. Plus, you love helping people. Absolutely. You like seeing people and making Absolutely. people happy. Yes, sir. And that's a pretty special character. Absolutely. Too. I believe it's one of the critical components for being, having a successful business for a long time. I totally agree. I totally agree. So what did I not ask you about that you wanted to tell me about? Or did you um, want to tell the folks out there about? Well, we just want to tell everybody to come out and check us out and, you know, give us a try. You know, if you haven't tried a good authentic taco, come try us out and, you know, let us know that it's your first time. And if you want to try a taco, I'm more than glad to let you have a taco for free so you can try it. That way you can get a little taste of what, we, what we're about, you know. A lot of people will come in and get a taco and they don't really, they have doubts about the food a little yeah, bit, like you know. Breakfast yeah, taco. so, you know, come in and try it, you know, and, and you know. Keep in mind, there are a lot of people moving from California. Absolutely. From York, I get new customers everywhere. every day. Every day I get new customers that walk in the door. And uh, I try to greet them, you know, make them feel at home and, you know, explain the menu to them. Uh, people from California, that be, a lot of people. And uh, they come in, they look at the menu, and they're kind of like, oh, is this a real place or not? Is this the real type of food that I'm looking for, you know? So when they taste the food, they're, they're, that's it, they're hooked, they're hooked. So they know that real authentic taste. Well, know? I wouldn't be here trying to promote you if I didn't believe that you guys have the best Mexican food, breakfast tacos around. Absolutely. And I want to ask one question, you got to answer it right. If somebody comes in looking for real estate, who are you going to tell them to see? King Wood Mortgage. King Wood Mortgage, baby. <laughs> Mike Dirt. Uh, you're the band. Yes, sir.